I've got nothing fun or witty to say. I was one of the people that bought this dang product. Ugh. You don't have super fractors in Sapphire. You have pad parancha, kind of like an off pink color. Yep, that's not red. That's pink. On May the 4th, we celebrated the 25th anniversary of Star Wars Episode One: The Phantom Menace, and Topps decided it would be a great time to rip open our wallets and celebrate in their own way with the release of 2024 Topps Star Wars Chrome Sapphire. Now, when this was first announced, I was genuinely super duper excited about it. Topps revealed some gorgeous imagery, including a dual autograph of Natalie Portman as Queen Amidala and Kira Knightley as her handmaiden Sabe. And then the price point came out, $299.99 a box. Well, Allie, you must be guaranteed an autograph for that much, right? Nope. Uh, you are getting four numbered cards out of 32 total cards in the box. I am still actually really excited about this product. I've had the luxury of opening up a few of these boxes for people as personal breaks. I do love the way the cards look. I love the color. I feel like we've been finding a good amount of lower numbered color. Like not everything is just numbered to 125. And you know, the Phantom Menace has a lot of great images of Padme, a lot of cool Obi-Wan pictures, a lot of fun stuff in it. So I still am excited about it. I just can't help all this shame that lurks over me for actually having bought this product. All right, here we go. Hopefully my neighbor's dog does not start barking again because that's a problem I now have to deal with. Apparently, ah, uh, the perks of living next to people. Where is my knife? I have a knife. Here it is. But yeah, we have a whopping eight packs in here, four cards a pack, 32 cards. Please, 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 let me pull an autograph. Tops, please, please. Tops giveth and they taketh away, so Tops please giveth to me. Just just one Natalie Portman, one of one autograph. Is that too hard to ask for? You can also pull, I didn't mention before, it slipped my mind. Samuel Jackson in here as well for another heavy hitter. Man, I wish. I want to say just this one time, can I have incredible luck? But I've pulled some really, really awesome cards. With my luck, I wouldn't be recording. But I pulled some lovely cards in my time. However, the craziest cards that I pulled have not been for myself, so I am hoping to, to cash in on some saved-up luck. Perhaps all my years of taking all the recycling from all the stuff that I opened, maybe that'll catch up to me and I can cash it out here on this 2024 Phantom Menace Sapphire. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. Nothing is missing. I can't, I can't even have copium where, oh, I had a pack missing. That missing pack totally had uh, something crazy in it. But nope, got everything here. I have no top loaders. I've been pulling pretty, pretty hot while I've had no top loaders in my apartment. Because literally, even though I'm at work each and every day, uh, I don't remember to go get top loaders. So thankfully I have sleeves. Let's go ahead and hop on into it. <laughs> oh, man. Oh man, here we go. I've been putting off opening this because I've been terrified of how bad it's going to go. But let's just let's go ahead and hop on into it. I'm curious though, those of you watching, oh my god, what is that? I don't like that. 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 All right, I have to do some research. What is this? This is all the stuff I bought on whatnot, right? Uh, yeah, yes, yes. You're not my. I look. I, my apartment's already become piled. What? What is? What is this? What is? Okay, here's a, here's a. This is not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for the red one. I'm looking for the red one. Oh my! I can't find anything. Look at this. This is sick. I got that. There's a. Random team break. These are more lightning cards. These are more lightning cards. All right. That's the purple. Where? I have a red one. I'm looking. I promise I'm digging for something relevant. I can't find it. Is it up here? What's this? No. This is Weiss cards. Where is my red? I have a red out of five. It doesn't look like that. I'm scared. I want to show you guys why I'm scared. Because we don't have super fractors in Sapphire. You have... It's not even on the box. It's... P P 
Pat Pad Paracha. It's kind of like an off pink color. Oh my god, I'm right here. It's under the. Yep, that's not red. That's pink. I'm terrified. I don't even know what it is. I don't even know what it is. I'm gonna ruin my zoom that I have. My beautiful footage is all messed up. I'm sliding around on the mat like a degenerate. Uh -huh. Sora. Oh my god. What is that? What are those? Sora, please. I'll tell you what, my lighting looks great though. Okay. All right. Um, we have a Dark Lord's Political Tactics. Ooh, Evil Spooky Palpatine. The Banished One! Okay. Does look like a base card, by the way. Protest from Padme! The Lady Doth Protest. Okay. Um, where's the numbering? Is located bottom... There's not really a good way for me to actually see what the numbering is on this. I got some random ass Pokemon codes. I am not gonna look. I'm not gonna look. Y'all better not look either. Okay. Now I don't know what card it is. I just want to see if I am literally freaking out for no reason. Shout out to these Temporal Forces pack codes. I'm terrified. I am... I'm doing way too much right now. Holy sh Dang it! It's a water one. Look at me making more effort for myself. God damn it. What is this? What is this? I can't even make the theme of my video is literally like, look how ashamed I am of buying this box. What even is that? Now we get to play. What scene is this? Okay. Sorry, the autism's leaking. Um... Can you guys even see that? It says 101. It's kind of hard to see. I f the pad parachas. Sick. What's the what's the card title start with? R. I don't know what card this is. I don't know what card this is. Um. Okay, the Pokemon codes are gonna hang out there. We're gonna just, we're gonna keep opening. Okay. Well, this doesn't start with an R, so it's unfortunately not the, the key piece I need of this rainbow. Um, um, I don't know what to do! Jedi make their way to the command deck. These cards are crispy, though. A new bet with Watto. Anakin's protocol droid. Now, oh, now I need to look for stuff that starts with the letter R. Duel of the Fates, and sir, Obi Wan. It's my sleeves. Yo, I didn't think that was actually gonna be a one on one. I was like, there's gotta be like some pink parallel that I don't know about. Because I've seen the purples, I've seen, well, I haven't seen, I haven't pulled a red, but I own a red, right? There's like the gold and orange. So the gold out of, or yellow and gold, right? You're out of. 75. This is the, the yellow. And then there's gold out of 50. They're very similar, to be honest. So I was like, oh, there's probably going to be something else, right? But where does this even open? Oh. Because it wasn't even closed. This is What the hell kind of shipping is this, bro? To be fair, I think I bought this for like $10. Which is a massive L on whatever... <laughs> on their, their average, right? So, okay, so if the box is like 300 bucks. Then every numbered card, especially if you, like, skunk out on pulling an auto or, like, a short print insert. There's a net loss on their piece per box. I don't, please don't send things in card savers. I know PSA requests it. I hate, I hate them so much. Okay. I'll have to find that later. I am so off my game right now. I don't even know what's going on. I'm just throwing things on the floor to make me feel better. Okay. Okay. I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't even know. We know it's on an auto, though. It's a bald bananakin. What the hell is... What the... 
what is wrong with this box? I can't even make a video about this box freaking sucks. Why did I buy this? What is this? What what is this? This product sucks. Let me just let me maybe if I Dang on it. it more, maybe I'll get a Nally Portmanto. This is so stupid. Weaving through the other races. I mean, to be fair, this this is not a card that I care about. This is not a card that I care about, but we'll take it. We'll take it. I'm taking all of it. Sebulba and Anakin Skywalker. Am I asleep right now? Is this a dream? The rebellious Qui-Gon. Feed falls to the Trade Federation Army. Is that have a bum corner? No, okay. I thought this corner was damaged. There's literally just a little tiny piece of sapphire crackling there that looks at, like when it catches the light that the corner's bent. I literally don't have top loaders. I think someone's probably live. I could literally go over there and get in the building, though. <gasps> I love this card! The Hunt for the Jedi! I must leave it. <gasps> I got my base card! Yeah! Quick thinking recovery. See, I was gonna, like, actually put this in the vault for, like, whenever I get lazy. Because I got stuff to record. I need to record this. I was gonna record this. And then I was like, I don't know what to do for the intro. So I'm gonna think about this. I'll do it tomorrow. I, I have to record this for Friday. This, com this comes out, 6-14. Oh, that's what I forgot to mention on Card Connection. Boat to the Rock comes out Friday, 6-14. Six, um, I also have a box of She-Hulk I need to record. Otherwise, Upper Deck's going to be like, you don't open anything. You suck. You're the worst content creator we've ever talked to. And I'll be like, you know, I, I, can't, even, I can't even argue with that. I've been, I've not been motivated. So I was like, oh, well, you know what? I, got, I look pretty eloquent. My hair looks okay-ish. I took the thumbnail that I could use for the- You know, let me just open this for fun. This is not fun! I'm terrified! I'm gonna have to, like, upload this. ASAP. I didn't want to do this ASAP. I wanted to take my time with it. I wanted to throw it in the vault for, like, eventually. What is this? <laughs> Yeah, I got- this is honestly what I had hoped for. Is just getting some good battle trade base cards so I don't have to buy them. Okay. Alright. There's orange. What? Are you out of 25? What? This is stupid. The Gungan shields fall. This is stupid. The trade Federation touches down on the boo. Boss Nass. Okay, well we know it's not a one one of this card. Stowaways. 25 of 25. This is stupid. This is stupid. This is stupid. This is so stupid. This is so stupid. I still have three packs left. That's the, it's not even over. Not even over. Alright. Hidden Underwater City. Creatures of the Deep. Shelter in the Skywalker Home. Quick Thinking Recovery. Why do I keep getting this card? Didn't I get one of these? Bro, what is this co- what? You know, I'm- I'm not even gonna complain about the collation. I was gonna say, what's this collation? I don't- uh, <laughs> I got two packs left. Alright, one more number card. Come on, give me an auto, give me an auto, give me an auto, give me an auto. Spice up the box even- ooh, purple. It's out of 125. Voting no confidence, the Queen's army mounts the attack. Blood sample analysis. <laughs> yeah, look at that. I own one sixty two point five of the Yeah, look at that. Of course, of course, of course, of course, of course. Yeah, they're so pretty. I really actually do like the sapphire cards. I really do like them. I really do like them. I wish I didn't. Expensive tastes. Alright, last pack, last pack. Alright. Alright, last chance for an auto here. Last chance for an auto here. I'm talking as if there's not a freaking 101 on the this, this screen right now. What do we What do we got? We got swarms of swar- uh, What? Arrival in Coruscant. The true queen revealed. And arriving at the hangar. Alright, so I got three pod racing inserts. I've got a mystery 101. 
It starts with the letter R. I don't know what card it is. None of the card, none of the base cards told me what card this was. I can't even cheat. Um, I don't remember what it was. When I opened the pack, I probably saw the name of it on the back, and I just didn't pay attention. Uh, this is in the top letter backwards. Whoa. This is in the sleeve backwards. I am procrastinating. Ooh. All right, so now we're back to having to actually guess at what this is. I mean, it looks kind of dark. I'm hoping that it's the scene where they're around the fire, like after they're like Qui Gon's funeral. Let's see. Let's see. It's dark. It's dark. It's dark. No, it's not gonna be that. What is it? Let's see the the name first. Repairs for Anakin's pod racer. Oh, it's probably gonna be something. It's R2! That's actually kind of cute. That's kind of cute. That's cute. That's cute. I should have zoomed in for you guys. I was too focused. Alright, so Anakin and Pod Racer 101. It's got R2 on it. It's cute. It's cute. It's cute. I mean, we, we, we call this box a W. W box. Alright. I just thought it might, because it looks really dark here. That is the only problem I have. The, the base? It's pretty actually easy to tell. It's once it gets to the color parallels, then it starts to look extra dark. I wonder if it's like an optical illusion. Just because, right? The color is like not on top of the image. You know, it, it kind of bleeds a little bit here. But yeah, I feel like you could still tell dark areas on the base cards. I wonder if it's just the way the darkness reacts with some of the 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 outer colors, like the pink. But hey, you know what? R2 101 here repairs for Anakin's pod racer. Card number 43. A few of Anakin's friends came along. Anakin has friends. Came around to see him working on his pod racer. They gave him a hard time and didn't believe that he would even be racing in the Bunta Eve Classic. However, Anakin's pod racer did successfully roar to life. Even that, they're like, Anakin's friends made fun of him. And then we wonder, why are you like this? It's like, wow. Anakin, Anakin really doesn't have a good foundation for, like, interpersonal relationships in general. Alrighty, so let's look at everything I got here. Battle droids, hell yeah. We had a red 5 of 5 weaving through other racers. Hell yeah, battle droids. And stowaways. Orange, 25 and 25. This is definitely a nice box. Definitely nice box. Duel of Fates insert, Obi-Wan there is cool. Um, I don't know how he duplicated the, the quick thinking pod racing insert. And we also had the arriving at the hangar pod racing insert. I got the two base cards I wanted. These. Honestly, I really wanted both of these cards. So I, I am thrilled. I am I am confused as to this. Like, I don't... I don't know, man. I don't know, man. I don't know. What the, I, I, you know I, I got nothing to say about that. But it, collation. Collation. Uh, I don't know how it did it, but... <laughs> it's cool. Pad Why didn't they just call it pink? What does Pad Parasha mean? I will have the full intent to look it up after we're done recording, and then I will be like, well, you know, I'm hungry. Let me go cook something, and then I will never remember to look it up. We'll see. I can't believe this, though. This was insane. All right, well, the Cone of Shame. I guess I didn't... I don't need to find... I was going to do a bit where I, I put the Cone of Shame on my head. Uh, I guess there's no Cone of Shame to be had here. This was a fruitful box. This is a fruitful box. Honestly, I will keep... My purple. And. I'll try. I'm going to try and put together a base set. These will probably be available for trade. If anyone's like, oh my goodness, Allie. I, I, I need that R2-D2 in my life. Well, let me know your cool your cool battle droid cards. Or, you know, Natalie Portman. Yeah. Can I trade this for a Natalie Portman autograph? Um, no, Kermit. You can't. But why not? It's a one of one. That means it must be ten thousand dollars. 
And it's chrome! That means it's $20,000. No, that's cool, though. That's cool. My brain hurts. I'm gonna stop the video. No, because I still have to go up top. <sighs> Can I at least, like, twist and deform in some, like, cool shape this time? Was that cool? Am I super cool? Am I the coolest cool person ever cool? Yeah, I know. I'm not. I'm not. Anyways, though. I will say this box, though, is this box is pretty cool. I, I am quite impressed with the pulls here. But no, this is this was actually fun. I like this product. I wish I wish it wasn't so expensive. It's hard to complain about the price point when I just open a box that had a one of one and an out of five in it. It's really it's really hard to honestly complain about anything right now. As much as my wallet hates me, I'm glad I did get a box and was able to share this with all of you because this was a ton of fun. But yeah, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you go ahead and hit that like button. Comments for me, leave them down below. And although that does it for me here in this video, before you go, why not go ahead and check out that one? I really think you'll like it. But all right, bye-bye, everyone.